What's up guys, welcome for another episode of Kuruchu RN and uh, it's cold now. I don't know why I'm wearing this but <laughs> and uh, because of the reason too we don't have a lot of rides anymore. We still do ride you know with all the jackets and all that stuff but it's lesser compared to you know the previous season. But anyway I am here in the house since I don't have any ride uh, and I have a computer issue so I cannot really post my three videos that it's been pending there so for now I just like to go back to my fat bob I didn't really made any videos about five things that I hate about it it's a nice bike I love it it's my baby but I do have five things that I don't like so let's get into it okay <music> So we are back and uh, as you can see here I got my fat bob the first thing that I would like to uh, start with the things that I don't like is that when I start it makes a big loud clunk and I don't I don't like it what I need to say is that when I put it into gear and you'll hear the, the clunk sound is not a quality sound you know every time we start it I always hear it and I, I hate it uh, most of the hardest are like that too but uh, I guess you have to live with it right might be really, really loud but I don't have any issues with my engine it's just that I don't like the sound second one is that I hate the uh, security about this uh, um, backrest I bought this for my wife I use it as a helmet holder <laughs> most of the time but the thing is that you cannot really leave it alone like this because it's really easy to take it out and it, this is not cheap you know this is expensive and being an OC guy I don't want to leave it alone you know in the parking lot so if I'm riding I always see that I have, you know, visual, uh, you know, confirmation or something like that <laughs> towards my bike. I always check it every time. And the thing that I don't like Number three, I'm fast with my list. <laughs> Third one is that uh, the, the rear view mirror that I have here, it always uh, blocks my view. I don't know what, it, what it's called, but it uh, elevates the angle of the mirror so that it goes beyond my arm. Because I, also, I always see my arm. So it's above my arm and I can see the back. And I also put a uh, you know like a all angle mirror something like that to help me with the with a blind spot but yeah and uh, if you're gonna buy the fat bob you always you know see, see this problem it just depends on how people deal with it some people like to take it out but I'm used to this this is how I ride even it was I was small you know in the Philippines this one how I ride I like my words to be on on top not the the opposite so yeah that's one of my gripes about this bike and then number four you always spend something for an exhaust right but considering this bike is above twenty thousand dollars when i bought it you should have a decent exhaust i don't really modify my bike a lot but because of the exhaust is not really good so I have to buy this uh, uh, what do you call this one uh, slip-ons uh, and it made a little bit better the sound is a little bit better and the drivers in the car can can hear me you know not as loud as the other exhaust but better right so you do have to spend something for this one because the uh, stock exhaust is really cheap
And last, but not the least, is that I hate these uh, pipes on the right side of my feet. Uh, it always burns my shoes. Shoes are expensive. I don't know why they made this way. Uh, it should have like a uh, like a, something like the box the the shoes. I don't know. And the foot bags is small too. That's kind of like one of the problems. So that area there is the number five that I don't like. The bag is, foot bag is really small and it hits the hot uh, pipe of the exhaust. I'm thinking about buying a, uh, a foot bag that's kind of like flat because you go on rides, especially it's really a long ride, your, uh, your feet is really tired and that's kind of like my de dilemma and I always wanted to see something that I could put into it there's uh, one that I saw but it's not really a Harley part I like my 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 bike to be all original so yeah I don't know if I can do something about it later on but uh, but as a whole as a uh, uh, the bike is it's a nice bike it's it's nimble it has a short wheelbase I'm used to it already it's fast even if it's not a 114 but it's still fast so yeah hopefully I can uh, modify this next year hopefully you like the video today um, I don't have a choice but I have to make this uh, video short uh, like I said I have a computer issue so hopefully I can post my my videos that I've been doing in the last three three weeks so thank you very much for watching uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, till next time bye bye Thank you.